Happy Saturday, Dome Dog Nation. So three ACC teams are in the final eight of the NCAA tournament. Duke, North Carolina, Miami. And Duke, not so much a surprise. North Carolina and Miami, definitely surprised. Those two teams, I think, can thank Syracuse for making it into the NCAA tournament because Syracuse, remember, played Miami twice and twice they had an 18-point lead against them and blew it. Miami loses those two games. They're not in the NCAA tournament. Syracuse had the ball on a one-point lead against North Carolina in Chapel Hill, and Gerard could not get the ball in balance. North Carolina ties the score. Game goes overtime. North Carolina wins that game. Then they go to Cameron. They beat Duke. They win a, a game in the ACC tournament, but then they win some huge games in the NCAA tournament, beating the defending champs, Baylor, and now a Final Four team in UCLA last night. Caleb Love was the man for North Carolina, just scoring 27 points in the second half. But Orlando Baycott, the big man, he made a couple big plays down the stretch. He saved the ball from going out of bounds, which got the ball back to Love to tie the score against UCLA. And then he got a tip in that pretty much cinched the game. North Carolina's going to take on the Cinderella store of St. Peter's this Sunday. The whole nation will be against them because it's a big-time program versus a very small school. But I think Baycott will be the, the key again. He may not have the most gouty stats, but he'll be key in that game because of his rebound ability and his intangibles, really. Affecting shots, going for rebounds, scoring when he needs to. But it'll be an interesting matchup between a huge program and St. Peter's on Sunday. Miami led by their two older guys, Cameron McGusty and Charlie Moore. Well, travel guys, first time Miami's ever been in the final eight, so it'll be interesting to see what they can do against Kansas. Duke against Arkansas, I hate to say it, but I think Duke's going to win just because they've just been getting, not getting lucky, but they've been executing at the end of games, which they weren't doing down the stretch of the season. You know, they could easily lost to Michigan State. They could easily lost to Texas Tech in this NCAA tournament. I think they're just destined to go to the Final Four, which is interesting because... If Coach K gets that win and they're in the Final Four and North Carolina wins, it'll be North Carolina Duke in the Final Four. So makes my buddy Adam Peterson pretty happy. That's all I got today. Enjoy the games. And so who's going to win the Duke versus Arkansas game? Maybe Arkansas. Okay. What about Villanova-Houston? Pick one. Villanova or Houston? Houston? All right, we'll see what happens.